So another installment of Bald Chef of Bergamo. And it's uh, about eight o'clock at night. Nice spring evening, beautiful, beautiful view. And we're gonna make a special dessert for my wife. Mother's Day is just around the corner, so this is a, an idea that everybody can use, to, something simple that everybody can do. So what are we gonna do tonight? We're gonna get some strawberries, fresh strawberries, slice them, wash them, and slice them. And then we're gonna take some leftover chocolate from Easter. Easter was just around the corner, how, uh, you know, two, uh, maybe a week, ten days ago. So let's take a little bit of the chocolate, and just a little couple pieces like this, and put it in a Pyrex container. All right, we're just talking a little bit of chocolate's all you need. We're gonna make a chocolate sauce. This is simple, everybody can do it. I learned this from my uncle. Um, I'm gonna add a little bit of milk, and what you wanna do is you wanna have enough milk to cover the chocolate. Just enough to cover the chocolate, like that. And then we're going to put it in the microwave, and we're going to warm it up, probably about 30 seconds or so. And then we're going to take the milk, separate the milk from the chocolate, mix it up, and then add back the milk slowly to make a nice, good, thick, creamy uh, chocolate sauce for the strawberries. So let's go over to the microwave. Simple. Yeah, nothing major. Clean microwave, thankfully. And we'll do this for about 30, 30 seconds and we'll see what we got. Okay, so it's been about 30, 40 seconds, and you can see that there's the, the milk's a little dark, but we wanna we wanna try to get the milk out and leave the chocolate in. It's okay if you have a little bit of milk because you're gonna need to add some milk back. So you can see that the chocolate is a little bit you know, more of it. A little moist. You can, now we're going to stir it up. Kind of get it nice and see if we got all the chunks broken out of it. And sure, we're, we're almost there. And then we're going to slowly add back in a little bit of the milk to get the consistency that we want. Keep stirring. And again, you can use whatever chocolate you want. You know, if you got leftover chocolate from Easter, use that. If you got some, you know, chocolate chips from for your chocolate chip cookies, go to that. Get some semi-sweet morsels. Dark chocolate's always better. We need to add a little bit more here because it's nice and thick. I want a little bit more milk. And I think that'll be the consistency that we're looking for here. Again, just stir it up. And this will be good. All the wives out there will love this. Trust me on this. Now let's get a look at this chocolate and see how that's kind of nice and perfect consistency. And then we're going to add it to the strawberries. That's a perfect, great use of chocolate. Get, a good, get, get to eat some fruit with it too, so you feel like you're healthy. Dark chocolate, they say, is good for you as well. This is perfect. Trust me, this is the way to, to eat strawberries. Of course, you can throw this on ice cream as well. You can dip a cookie in here. This is perfect. Bon appetito.